Hi, I'm George from Theatre Sound Supplies and I'm here today to explain how we use wig clips and elastic to fit microphones into a performer's hairline. Using microphones concealed in the hairline is one of the most popular positions used by sound designers. To achieve this, we usually use wig clips and elastic to attach the microphone and then carefully fit it into a performer's hair. To start, you're going to need three or four wig clips. These come in a range of colours and sizes and it's down to personal preferences to which you choose. Now take the elastic and tie a knot in one end of it. We then take the clip and poke the elastic through the small hole on one side, across the clip and through the opposite hole. It's really important that you get the clips the right way around so that the elastic runs alongside the metal bar. This means that the clip can open and close and we can fit it to a performer. Once we've checked this, we need to tie another knot in the elastic and then trim the ends down. We now need to repeat that process three or four times to ensure the microphone can be securely fitted. In order to attach our clips to the microphone, we simply loop the microphone through the elastic twice, making sure there's some movement in the clips. We now repeat the process using the other clips we made earlier. It's always good to make sure the clips are facing the same way so that it's easier to fit when we have a performer in front of us. When fitting the microphone, the first thing to do is part the hair, making a channel for the microphone to run down. Starting at the front, place the capsule of the microphone at the height you want it. Using the first clip, simply slide the teeth into the hair as close to the scalp as possible. To close the clip, push down against the performer's head. Some performers may prefer you to use a tail comb when fitting the clips, as this can be a little bit uncomfortable. Continue working backwards with the clips until they're all secure. Once this is complete, all you need to do is push the hair back over the cable and that's your mic fitted. I'll put a link in the comments below so you can have a look at the wig clips and elastic available to you. Thanks for watching this video and be sure to subscribe for more tips, tricks and product reviews from us here at Theatre Sound Supplies.